Good Sunday, everyone. I hope you're doing well on this fine uh, January 22nd. And <laughs> let's see what the day was. Uh, it is podcast day, and I'm about ready to record. I just need to write. That yeah, I just need to write that much. <laughs> Actually, that much. I need to write a sentence worth. I need to write the intro uh, so I could get this going. <laughs> I'm not sure what to say yet, so uh, thinking about it recording a little bit. All right, I've got the script done. I've got my hair all over the place. <laughs> and uh, I am ready to record. So like always, here's a quick tour of the podcasting equipment. This is my Behringer Zenix 802 mixing board. That's how you spell Zenix. Um, I've had this for a while. It's fairly inexpensive. Um, and it does the job really well. This is my MXL 990 microphone. I've had this one for a while. I really like it. It's been really reliable. It's on a mic stand with a nice pop filter. Got to watch those peaks. This is my Behringer U-Control UCA202 USB interface. It connects my mixing board to the laptop. And I record and mix and do everything else on my Dell Windows 10 laptop. And I use the free program, Audacity, to record and mix the podcast in. I write up the podcast throughout the week using Google Docs. I find it reliable. I can use it just about anywhere. And, uh, yeah, Google Docs. It's free. Use it. <laughs> When I get ready to publish uh, the show notes, I uh, copy the script over from Google Docs into Markdown Pad. Um, you can use the Markdown language uh, to quickly format the show notes. Oh, and I left out one more important piece of equipment. My cheap headphones. <laughs> uh, these are better than what I had. <laughs> but, uh, hey, they get the job done. They let you hear yourself while you record. Yeah, that's it for the uh, all the equipment that I'm using to record this podcast. I hope you enjoyed that and got some information. I actually picked up everything here except the laptop at uh, Amazon. So uh, just head on over. And yes, that is a small Christmas tree. I keep it out all year round. I really like it. I just recently swapped out its lights for these nice uh, multicolored LEDs. I think it adds a splash of color to my own. Okay, one last thing we have to do, and it's one of the most important things about a podcast we have to do. We need to put this phone on silent. There. Oop, oh, can't hear you. Okay, now I need to do my audio levels and uh, do a couple of practice read-throughs, and we'll get recording. So uh, what you're going to hear is uh, my read-throughs of some of the stuff in the script. I'm happy to announce as of January 22nd, 2017, Blog Oklahoma has 917 registered Oklahoma bloggers. Your feedback is important, so please feel free to contact me with your comments or questions. You can get hold of me in a multitude of ways. Just visit blogoklahoma.net slash contact for more information. In this week's episode, we explore more Oklahoma history and why the markers say what they say. And I share five great YouTube channels for you to check out. Oh, and if you hear some rumbling in the background, that's just the wind. Okay, it's time to record. So as always, welcome to Blog Oklahoma. See you in a little bit. Well, I have most of the segments done except for the main topic, which is the longest. I need to take a break for a minute. <laughs> um, it's going to be quite long, so I uh, need to get a drink, walk around, come back, be refreshed, and ready to go. Well, had a little tiny change in my configuration while I took the break. I keep forgetting I have this laptop stand. And now, <laughs> the script is at eye level, so I can see it over the microphone. Okay, enough goofing off. Time to get back to work. See you in a little bit. All right, uh, only had to do several takes of that. <laughs> but I got it in, I got it recorded, I got it saved. So now we need to do some noise reduction, pull in some music, give it a good mix, and then I'm done. Well, the new episode is now up. I've got it published everywhere. If you don't see it in your favorite podcatcher, uh, wait a few moments while uh, the uh, feeds start to synchronize. But 
Well, I hope you enjoy this week's episode of the Blog Oklahoma podcast. It was actually quite a bit of fun to write over the week. And uh, hopefully you enjoy it and get some information out of it. It was all about why historical markers say what they say. Also want to remind everyone, we have our own Roku channel. So uh, be sure to check it out. You can install it at uh, blogoklahoma.net slash Roku. And the new episode should be, there it is, ready to go. In this week's episode, we explore more Oklahoma history and why the historical markers say what they say. And I'll share five great YouTube channels for you to check well, out. Well, that's going to do it for me today. And i got to do something with this hair. Um, it was a lot of fun to put out today's episode. It was a lot of fun to put together. And uh, hopefully, again, that you like it. Please send me feedback at blogoklahoma.net. Oh, just a reminder, I mentioned it in the podcast. There will be no new episode next week. I've got to do something next weekend. But uh, I will be back again in two weeks with an all-new episode of the Blog Oklahoma podcast. Until next time.